Hi, Kickstarter. My name is Daniel Garcia. I am a senior level aerospace engineer here at the University of Central Florida, representing on this year's uh, student launch competition for the University of Central Florida. Um, the competition this year is a little bit more challenging than the previous years, whereas we have to make an autonomous robot in order to pick up a panda and put it inside the rocket and then launch the rocket. Um, now some of my team members will talk more on the specifics over what is required in this competition. Hi, my name is Greg Harmling. I'm a mechanical engineer, senior level here at the University of Central Florida. This year for the USLI competition, we've been tasked with creating and designing and implementing an autonomous rover that will be able to collect, contain, and displace a payload autonomously into a rocket that we have built. Uh, right here to my right is Michael Hopper. He'll be our lead programmer. We're going to be using an open source computer vision library. So using that, we're going to navigate the robot into the correct locations to using an arm that's going to be on the rover, pick up our payload and take that and put it into the rocket. Okay, so the suspension that we're using on our robot is kind of modeled after the suspension that they use on the current uh, Mars Curiosity rover. It's like a bogey rocker system that helps the robot be able to go over rocks and mountains and such. Hi, my name is Brendan Cowan. I'm a first year mechanical engineering major here at UCF. I'm really excited to be a part of SEDS here at UCF. Uh, they're a bunch of intelligent people who are really motivated and passionate about what they do here. And I'm really excited about what we're about to do in the future. Hi, I'm Cody Pike. I'm a senior aerospace engineer with SEDS. Um, I'm tasked with the material selection, stress, and flow analysis for the Project Ares rocket. Um, I, it's like we, we do this analysis so we can ensure uh, the, our launch vehicle will survive flight and mission success. Hello, my name is Jeremy Young. I'm the current president of the Students for the Exploration and Development of Space here at the University of Central Florida. I'm going to show you a little bit about some of the rocket design that we're doing for this year's uh, NASA Student Launch Competition. Here we have our subscale model. This is what we have physically in front of us uh, to my right. Um, here's our finished model. The mission of our rocket this year is to launch to a target altitude of 3,000 feet. Uh, it's going to have a payload that's going to be inserted into it inside of the rocket by the robot that the other team, is, the robotics team is building. Um, it then has to uh, deploy that payload and parachute down on its own when it reaches an altitude of 1,000 feet. And then we're going to have our main chute come out at approximately 500 feet. Hi, my name is Diego Espina. I'm a senior aerospace engineering student here at the University of Central Florida. Uh, I'm the lead in the avionics and electronics as well as the safety officer uh, during the project. Um, during our flight, uh, we're going to be recording uh, live uh, a lot of uh, the data as well as uh, our altitude and vertical acceleration of the rocket. Um, we'll also be tracking the GPS positioning of the, of the vehicle as well as the payload. Um, all of these things would be um, monitored uh, while the launch is happening.